Since the dawn of man, we have been having ideas that have helped to make our lives better. And it's the realization of the best ideas and innovations that has helped shape the world we live in today. Innovation in the NHS is a hot topic. As NHS professionals, we're constantly being reminded of how innovation can improve patient care or help to reduce costs. But what exactly is innovation and why is it so important? Firstly, we need to understand the difference between an idea and an innovation. An idea is a thought or concept that exists in the mind, but an innovation is the implementation of that idea to provide a significant benefit to others. The main barrier for developing ideas and innovation is not a lack of creativity, but recognition of the impact an idea could have. Talking with your colleagues or patients can help you to understand the impact of your idea and innovation. When developing an innovation, it's important to remember that the simplest option usually works the best. For example, Dr. Shazia Hafiz was a year one junior doctor who came up with a low infection risk solution to carry the medical instruments required during training. Dr. Sarah Haynes and Mohadeen Jamil co-invented the SwabTech device to enable better red blood cell salvage during operations and reduce the reliance on blood donation services. It's important to constantly ask yourself whether there's a simpler way to do things. To create change and help people's lives, you shouldn't be tucked away in your cave working alone. The best innovators are the ones that call on the skills and knowledge of the experts surrounding them. The NHS in the Northwest has a strong support network that can develop highly skilled professionals that understand how to deliver excellent healthcare services and patient care validate clinical needs and facilitate collaborations with scientists and engineers. Protect your innovation and find suitable commercial partners to help develop or manufacture it. Provide office space and business support when you want to spin out a company based on your innovation. If you're not based in the Northwest, speak to your organization's research and innovation manager or your regional NHS innovation hub. Remember to utilize the help that's available to you. Successfully commercialized ideas can help your trust to generate income. Through collaboration with manufacturers and developers, the NHS can earn royalties from products sold globally, which can help NHS organizations to operate more efficiently. Not only that, as an inventor, you can also earn royalties, which can bring that yacht a step closer. Don't forget, proper negotiation with collaborators is essential. Being innovative makes you a better doctor. Your ideas can differentiate you from your peers and strengthen your profile, which can help to secure exciting or interesting roles in the future. Your actions can inspire your colleagues to think about new ways to improve the care they deliver. And by being innovative, you're actively working towards making happier, healthier patients. So now you know more about how to be an innovator, what will you do with your ideas?